Hi, my name is Malik, and I'm the Training and Planning Manager at Interconnect Wiring, where connections matter. Today, we'll be looking at how we make a hat and what the symbols on them mean. There are many ways to make a harness assembly drawing, otherwise known as a HAD, at Interconnect. But by far the most common way is to get a dimension drawing from our customer that has their own symbols, their own notes, and their own special characters. Our job at Interconnect is to take that information and refine it so that we can make an Interconnect HAD that is easier and more standardized for our assemblers to use. Let's take a look at the example on the table. So for an example of what we transfer to our HADs Interconnect wiring are these general notes. And these are the inf this is information that the assembler is going to use to manufacture their harness and that we believe is relevant. Not every note may be transferred, specifically part subs may be left out because it's not helpful for the assembler. Once it gets to them, this is all they need to build. Another example of information that we add to our har harness assembly drawings here are going to be our ref deses, tubing sizes, connector orientation, noting that there's a shrink ref des tubing at this location. Stuff like this is going to help our assemblers manufacture their harnesses in a better, faster way. And this section of the hat is where we really make it our own. And we have our custom chart or legend that denotes our special colors that our assemblers understand, as well as our own symbols, including a cut line. One special piece to note is the CUI Controlled Unclassified Information Sticker that denotes the importance of this document and how it should not be taken from these premises. And another method to make a hat at Interconnect Wiring is to dig up one of these. So this fossil is known as a mylar. These are really, really old pictures of a previously designed form board in which they use tape, notes, and different kinds of methods to mark down exactly what the harness would look like and how it would be built. These are dimensioned, so you can make a hat at interconnect off of this, but oftentimes we'll elect to use these, especially for making a panel harness or something similar. Thank you for watching. I'm Malika Interconnect Wiring, where connections matter. Be sure to visit our website for more vlogs, blogs, and updates.